Hello, this is Wayne from GSG, coming to you loud and proud from Louisiana, and the Wasteland Electrician has been hard at work. We have been working here at the Green Top Nursery after having finished off the Tin Pines Farm. And we will highlight uh, some of these well-lit areas out here in the Wasteland in a future episode. And as you can see, old Cupcake's got a few upgrades here as well. But right now, the Wasteland Electrician and Major are about to go check out this insane asylum before we get back with Preston. I'm going to go see what's going on over there. So we are about to um, head on out. But as you can see here at the Green Top Nursery, we got us a radio tower up and a little bit of... Uh, a little bit of electricity running around, not a whole lot, but we got her started. So we got some lights up here in our walkway, and we have our radio beacon up and working. So that is kind of one of the most important things. We've uh, attracted us a few settlers here at the camp. Alright, but there's a little look at it in the daylight. It looks a little better uh, in the dark. But uh, me and Major are about to go find out what's up at this nursery. I mean this insane asylum. So, let's head off, Major. Uh, bid us farewell, folks. We have never been to this location, so we have no idea what to expect. Now, uh, I know just scrounging around in the area, Major and I did come across this Assaultron. We'll take that. This is Soltron robot right over in this area. Somewhere. She was pretty nasty looking. Alright, let's see. There appears to be a bridge. I don't know if her corpse is still around or not. But she was kind of hanging out in this area. I caught a glimpse of her once before. Um when we were taking on these mutants but fortunately um, she may have even been killing mutants herself I don't know what she was doing but she wasn't attacking me which was good because I was totally not prepared for it the heck is this flying bugs I hate flying bugs Didn't mean to do that, meant to do this. What you get for spraying me with all that gunk? Good job there, Major, holding them off of me. That is probably all of them. We'll use that to cook up in some kind of good grub. Alright, let's figure out. I'm kind of trying to get a little look at this place. Uh, we are not completely out of electrical components. Uh, we have uh, managed to scrounge quite a bit. 
Um, we got us a good haul out of the Vault 75 area. We utilize that to um, square up 10 pines and get started on the Green Top Nursery. Alright, we're getting a little far away from our intended target, but apparently this road is our only way around this water. And who knows what this place is? But it looks inhabited, Major. Who is this guy? Friend or foe? I would say he's a foe. <coughs> he would be a foe, buddy. Yeah, we got time to pick flowers in the middle of a firefight. Is anybody pursuing us? Don't come messing with me, bruh. I was just, uh... We gotta handle this dude. We gotta handle this dude with some retreating. You ain't cooking me, buddy. Damn, that's pretty intense, bruh. We gotta run. This fool go with the flamer. Yeah, don't mess with me. Damn scatter laser. Got a little flame of my own, fool. Fracking nukes, what the hell? We done started a war here, boys. I hope y'all are ready. <laughs> oh, blowed you up, buddy. Sucker done flank me. Major, I don't know where you are, but I hope you, uh. I hope you scattered, buddy. I'm not ever gonna find all these bodies. <coughs> no friends that's for sure the heck did I just kick off of here I could have swore I already looted this place 
We'll loot it again. Somebody back over here. Might want to reload, buddy. Let's see, I was uh, in the guard tower, so he was probably behind these trees. Man, we just wanted to go check out the insane asylum fools. People, peeps got some kitted out gear, man. Come on, Major, you're gonna have to help me find these corpses. Oop, found a leg. We find the next one, boy. Was that one out with that nasty flamer? That should have been it. Why they didn't have a flamer on them? They sure was cooking me with it. many we blowed up major it was a pretty intense uh, scrap hey I don't know if that's my blood or somebody else's probably my blood come on major I know we shot some people around here Let me find him, boy. You see anything? All right, come on. Well, they was definitely in hot pursuit, boy. Let's see. Uh, that's one set of armor. Two sets of armor. Man, all that's better than what we got, buddy. What the heck are we wearing? 28 and 35. Oh, heck yeah, that's time for an upgrade, buddy. Ah, uh, that's why it's the whole suit. It looks kind of cool, but uh, it ain't what we want. All right, well, that's why. We're going to put our own stuff back on. Uh, do I already got a left leg on? I'm not sure. All right, we should be back to our regular self. All right, boy, well, them, uh, whatever this place is, ain't no joke. I don't know 
know what they got around here for right now, but we got to steer clear of them fools. Oh, we done found some other place, boy. We trying to make our way over here to this insane asylum. Alright, well we are already detected. And they don't appear to be shooting at us. Aren't you working on the swimming pool, buddy? And you guys got your little farm going on? Who's the leader around here? Jones. Hey there. Wiseman is a great man and a great leader. What's more, I owe him my life. Well, that's it. I used to live in Diamond City. I got into some trouble and it was Wiseman who bailed me out. Wiseman? Who in the heck is Wiseman? Oh, there you go. Hi. Welcome to the Welcome to the slog. We're the only tarberry bog in the Commonwealth. So what do you think of the place? The slog. <laughs> the slog? How'd you come up with that name? We didn't. It was the caravan traders who started that. I started this place a few years back, but couldn't think of a name for it. Then one day, one of the traders pulls up after it's been raining for hours and says he's never had to slog through so much mud in his life. I asked him if it was worth it, and he said, for the best tar berries in the Commonwealth, it was definitely worth it. Working here is like a slog through the mud. It's tough going, and you'll get dirty doing it. But at the end of the day, it's worth it. You probably noticed it's only ghouls around here. I used to live in Diamond City, until that rat bastard mayor threw me and all the other ghouls out. I decided that we ghouls should have a place where we could feel welcome. And that's mainly why I started up this farm. I would looks say like you've, you've done, done well, well for yourselves. It's a good start, yeah, and I'm proud of all the work we've done. Still, I think we can do more. What if this place could be more than just a refuge for ghouls who aren't welcome elsewhere? What if it could also be an example of what we can do when we put our minds to something and work together? We want this to be a place that everyone looks forward to visiting, with smiling faces, good bargains, and great produce. Maybe we can make people take a second look, you know? Maybe then they'd see that we're not monsters. Roger that. That's a great idea. Yeah, I think it's a great idea. Yeah. Thanks for saying so. Why don't you take a look around? Deirdre's always looking to trade supplies for caps, and Holly could use a hand gathering tar berries. It's been good talking with you. I hope you'll visit us again. Oh, wise man, you're going to be glad you met the uh, Wasteland Electrician, because I'm going to hook you boys up. This looks like a nice little settlement right here. And you guys can go slog around in that... uh swimming pool and uh, get all the tar berries you want. Mm -hmm. And over here. And what you doing here, buddy? You putting together um, a little horse? Hello. Huh? Oh, excuse me. Sorry. <sighs> Sorry, didn't mean to ignore you. Just got caught up in my work again. So, what do you think? Nice, isn't she? What is it? What is that? Some kind of toy? It's not just any toy. It's a genuine Getty Up Buttercup. The 2076 Special Edition. Best toy on the market before the war. It's a shame, though. I don't have all the parts to get this old girl working again. Don't suppose you happen to have a spare crate of toy parts on you? Toy parts? What do you need? Omnidirectional servos, piezoelectric actuators, superconductive mesh wiring. 
This was top-of-the-line stuff, even before the war. You won't find it just lying around. Well, man, you're talking about uh, the greatest um, electrician left in the wasteland, buddy. I'm going to hook you up. Sorry, no. Of course not. But mm, I think I know where you could find some. That's what I not was hoping, buddy. Not the most buddy. glamorous job, but I'm willing to pay. You interested? Heck yeah. All right. All right. I'll do it. Thanks. This really means a lot to me. There's only one place to look for parts like this. The old Automatoys factory, south of Quincy. Not gonna lie. It's at the far end of the Commonwealth. That whole area's a death. Trap, gunners, and worse. Even for you, it might be too much. But if you're ever down that way, don't forget about me. Now, where was I? All right, you uh, get back to working on that uh, giddy up buttercup, Mr. Arlen Glass, and uh, the Wasteland Electrician's going to find the stuff you need. Alright, so apparently um, we need to do some stuff. Um, go to Diamond City. Well, what do I got to do to uh, get these people friended on my side? Holly, that's who I need to talk to. Excuse me. If you want to help us out, hop in the pool and gather some tar berries. I'll pay you caps for each one you bring me. You bring me tar berries, and I'll give you caps. If you're really lucky, maybe I'll give you something else. Ooh, I'll just take the tar berries. Thank you. Gotta do something to get you peeps all friendly and nice on my side. Excuse me. to get paid for those tower berries or are you here to uh, admire the goods uh, yeah I'll take those caps now here you go two caps per berry thanks much all righty hey then yeah huh well that's it then huh girl Could, uh, really could utilize this place around here, but uh, I need to do something to get you guys friendly on my side. Only one dude giving me a quest. All right, come on, Major. Well, we have located the farm of ghouls. And we're going to try to ally them up, so we ain't going to try to rob none of their stuff. We're going to keep trying to make our way over here to this asylum. We can ever figure out how to get over there. Do you 
think we got here, boy? Let's loosen this baby up. There you go. That's it. What kind of stuff can we find up in this place, Major? Ooh, yeah, a hot plate. Here you go. Hold up, boy. Hold up, boy. Hey. Get rid of some of this Raider gear on you. Ooh, that's heavy. That's a one, two, three, four, five. All right, we killed about five of them guys. So that'll be, uh, maybe we did find them all. I'd like to have found that flamer. It would have been nice to have found that flamer on the ground. behind a locked door. There wasn't really much in here, was there, boy? Alright, I will see. She's looted up. Alright, come on, boy. Definitely need to be weary of these uh, raiders over here. Ooh, is there some on the bridge? There is. Man, getting to this insane asylum uh, is a little bit trickier than it looks, huh, boy? And I will imagine these people are not friendlies either. But I try to always give them the benefit of the doubt. Saint of charity, five hundred caps. Or you ain't going anywhere. We can't afford that. Please, we're just what? What? Here's your 500 caps. Well, maybe that's what it takes for us to get in tight with the uh, with the ghouls here, Major. We ain't paying no 500 caps across a bridge. Hey there. Thanks, stranger. That's more than most would have done. Hi. You saved our lives. I th Thank you. Thank you. Well, they wasn't even ghouls. Apparently we can cross the bridge now, Major. I'm 
most importantly be on the other side of this water. None of these fools gonna stand in between the wasteland electrician and his parts. Killing what we got around here. I don't see anybody, boy, but don't mean there isn't anybody. somebody run run major Raider got eight. Damn, that thing's flipping over cars. You peeps should have stayed in this trailer. Seeing as you did, I don't think you're going to need any of this stuff. Come on, Major, where are you at? Hey, over here. We shed a little bit of this weight. Looks like we both looted up, boy. All right, but this is our fallback spot. If they get too stupid, boy, we run for the bus. Run, run to the bus. Good job, boy. I'm not trying to get you killed, but run. What? 
We almost got him, boy. Dang, we both overloaded too, Major. Let's see. Let's eat us some of these. And drink us some dirty water. That got us right at the amount of weight. Alright, boy, I'm determined to get to this uh, insane asylum. It's been a slightly crazier than we expected. some electricity boy which that's a good thing we might be able to scrounge you some stuff oh if it ain't one thing it's a damn another Find this flesh wound. Ooh, I see some opposition. Dang boy, we are in desperate need of a container to store some gear. We are overweight and cannot run. All right, boy, let's do this. After that one truck blew up on me, I don't, I don't care much for hiding out near cars. Oh yeah, they definitely got them some good electricity going on over here, boy. this way boy Hang tight, Major.
guard must have ducked off into somewhere, boy. Looks like they got him a pretty good walled-in community, that's for sure. But just because there's a front gate doesn't mean that's the gate we got to go in, does it? Dang, what's that? I got all kind of stuff to explore out here, boy. You would think, uh, having lived here 200 years ago, I might know what some of this stuff was around here, but, uh... That is most definitely an inhabited place. They got some electricity there, too. I know, boy, this would be a little bit faster if I could find somewhere. How much am I overweight? Four pounds. Um, let's see. Let's uh, drop this. Let's eat us some uh, iguana soup. We'll drop some blue fly meat. All of it. Alright, boy. If we need some blue fly meat, we know where to get it. Oh, yeah, baby. And just like that, we're in the back door. Back gate, buddy. And I just want to make sure that guard ain't coming around this way. Because you never know, it's a slight chance it could be friendly. storage shed Ooh. need to pay attention to where I'm going huh boy all right we'll give this place a thorough uh, look over boy Ooh, what's this I thought that was a part uh Find us a container in here. Yeah, we can, baby. Got us no tools. Take that. And we could use this old this track. This is off limits. Move along. You trespass. This place is off limits. Move along. This is private property. All right, bro. I got you. This 
place is off limits. Move along. Yeah, I'm moving along, buddy. I don't want you shooting at me. Alright, well at least he didn't uh start shooting at us on major. Ooh, what we got over here? We got something else back here, boy. Well, we investigated the insane asylum. We at least discovered it. And they got some roving guards, so it'll be a little tricky to get in there, but you guys remember to have fun, be safe, and don't forget to reload. We will be back with another exciting episode of The Wasteland Electrician soon. Alright, we all loaded up.